Level 2. The Basement. Level Classification. Difficulty 2 out of 5 rate on gas leakage alongside entity count makes this level difficult to inhabit. Entity count 3 out of 5 large quantities of common entities reside on this level. Chaos Gradient 0 out of 5. Bassett Fraser Index 1.6 out of 5 This level is slightly anomalous, at least relatively. Description Level 2 is a series of seemingly infinitely long concrete brick halls running parallel to one another and connected occasionally by short, sideways running halls. The halls have no ceiling and the walls appear to extend upwards indefinitely. Frequent beams and catwalks cut across and run through the space overhead. The beams often have fluorescent lights strung from them, constantly flickering. The infinitely receding beams hung with lights have often been likened to a night sky filled with stars. This infinite web of beams and lights has been dubbed the Capwell Matrix and is a fairly common lighting system in the back rooms, appearing in several levels. Additionally, the catwalks can be used as a fast way to traverse the level, although they lack a connection to the ground so they're difficult to access and are infested with much higher concentrations of entities. The long hallways have been noted to curve slightly in the distance, implying they're in fact circular and that the level has a center, although the center has never been reached. Level 2 is made up of grimy stone brick walls with a dirty concrete floor. The floor is carpeted in some areas using a carpet similar to that of level 1 and is stained or covered in plaster in others. Some walls are cracked or broken, made with cindered blocks, or have cog in them. Large amounts of dust cover the floor in most objects, although it is not organic dust but rather stone dust. Stirring up the stone dust is advised against, as it will fully air and cause breathing problems for anyone in the area. Similar to level 1, level 2 has leaves of an oily red liquid, which runs from cracks in the walls and can occasionally fall from the beams. This liquid is slightly acidic in nature and it causes nausea and vomiting when consumed. It can discolor concrete and burn hairs on contact. Many areas are contaminated with radon. These areas do not seem to grow and the ones near settlements have been sectioned off with yellow caution tape. It is rumored that the center at level 2 contains a large vault of supplies. This rumor varies from person to person, with some people claiming to have seen it. Some people claim it resupplies itself and others claim that it is limited. As of this entry, the BRU and the BEA are currently mounting an expedition through the catwalks to the center. Communities. CGS Outpost Colby. The Cult of the Golden Sword is a relatively unorganized faction, and they are comprised mainly of treasure hunting hopefuls, meaning the majority of their outposts are on fairway levels where riches are to be found. Colby is among the only exceptions, established as a political base upon their joining of the UNP. It is populated by at most 50 citizens, though that number fluctuates frequently. Liberated Outpost Eros. Eros is the main base of operations for the liberated, housing at any given moment approximately 200 permanent residents. As the liberated major players in the political game of the backrooms, Arieros is heavily guarded at all times, and a significant portion of their high-ranking officials reside there. Assorted Camps Camps around level 2 are typically around the same areas. One very large camp lays abandoned and has a massive cloud of radon blocking the entry. Other camps are spread out and are apart from others. Entrances and Exits Entrances Level 2 can be entered by taking a special staircase in level 1. This staircase is typically marked with basement or below ground floor. Doors around level 1 also enter into level 2. These doors are marked with a down arrow. Any of this level's sublevels are also entrances. Exits. The only exits from level 2 are hatches that lead even further down into level 3. Other exits include level 2 sublevels, 